my beautiful flowers my husband got me, you guys. Look at the blue and the white. Oh, they almost green and the pink. These are gorgeous. He just brought them home and surprised me. He brought home groceries and then he brought these home with it. I appreciate good flat. I mean, I just appreciate flowers. And I put it in my little quench. This is my little watering can thing from Ray Dunn. Love it. So I'm gonna have these sitting in there. Just a nice way to, well, to end a Friday. Cause you guys, I have had a heck of a week and I've been in a bad mood and hubby knew it. And he just thought he might bring me some flowers to brighten up my day, you guys. And that makes me feel so much better. So talk at you guys later. Bye-bye now. Hey y'all, it's Lady C in the place to be. Lady C's Lifestyles. Hey y'all, happy Friday. We made it y'all to another Friday. We made it through this weekend. I had a hard one, but you know what? I did it. Hubby came home with the groceries, you guys. And he also bought me some flowers because he knew just how hard it has been for me this weekend. I thank him. Yes, I do. Ain't they pretty? Look at that, you guys. Just pretty. But anyway, I thank him. Put a little bit of sunshine in my day. Yes, he did. So I'm going to go through this grocery haul. Um, hubby stopped by the H Mart. If you don't have an H Mart near you, man oh man just look for the nearest asian market um but our nearest one is the h mark um of course it says the best of asia in america since 1982 and it's um hmart.com if you want to look them up groceries and more that's them okay we also went to weiss for like, i think like maybe three of the items here but i'm going to show you guys what we picked up and i'll give you the prices okay Let's get with the meat. You know, I always got to get with the meat. Well, I guess we got these from Weiss. This is, you guys, um, I don't even know what he picked up. I hope he marked it. Okay, this is Rockfish Filet, um, product of the United States. Everything that we pick up, you guys, now has a something on there saying it came from the United States. We used to buy things back in the day, and it just was what it was. It didn't matter whether it came from where you bought it. But anyway, this is from Weiss. It's Rockfish Filet. Um, we're going to have these. This is going to be our fish Friday. We kind of have started doing fish on Fridays. Um, I don't mind fish, fish any time of the week, but um, we kind of do fish on Friday. So we're going to do that today. And this was 0 0.968 pounds. Uh, the total price is $14.39. Um, looks like we got a pretty big amount. So I don't know. It might not have been too bad. But anyway, seafood, you know, these days is very expensive. So that's that. Um, now we're back to the Asian market. This is H Mart. We picked up some um, bagogi meat. Um, this says enjoy on the grill. We don't normally grill ours. We use it in bagogi and we cook it in our pan on the stove. Um, this is frozen beef thin, ribeye roll, six to eight up bagogi. Um, it's $1.29 a pound. Yeah, I guess, no, one point. I guess it's 1.29 pounds. What am I saying? And the, um, we paid $12.89. This is normally expensive anyway, you guys, but this is really good. And you can get a lot out of this pack. Like, these look like big pieces. We usually cut these up really, really small. This probably could do us for maybe two, uh, two meals of the bagogi. So that's not too bad for $12. I would say maybe $6 a meal. So not too bad. So we picked this up. Let me move some of these things around, you guys. Okay. Now, this is something that I love, and it's so easy. I love for hubby to pick these up. This is the shrimp tempura. You get 10 pieces, net weight, uh, 9.17 ounces. You keep these frozen, and you get a whole thing. See how these are? You have, If you've ever seen shrimp tempura, these are the shrimp tempura. They're just shrimp cooked in the tempura batter, and they're straight. And I like to eat these with meals. Um, we like to eat these with noodles. I just love them. And this is a 10-pack. Um, I don't know what the price was, you guys. Let me see. Let's see if we can find out what the price on these was. Okay, this was $8.99 for a 10-pack. 
not bad you guys these are so yummy we my husband usually makes a little sauce for these and oh yummy so anyway sometimes we will make these ourselves you can do it yourself but you know it's just as easy to pick them up at the um asian market we also picked up with that um oops can't see where is it, y'all? Okay. Hubby picked up some of this Jenga sliced Napa cabbage kimchi. We just got a small thing of it because it's just the two of us. Um, we love kimchi, you guys. It is yummy, yummy. Um, this was made in Korea. Uh, what else does it say, you guys? Best before July 11, 2023, which is fine because this should be way gone by that time. Um, but we did pick this up. Now, again, we would eat this with noodles. We would eat this with shrimp tempura. We would eat with magogi. We eat with a lot of things. So, this is really, really good stuff. Um, oh, and let me give you the, the pricing on the kimchi, you guys, was... I don't even... Oh, the kimchi was... On, oh, this is only $4.99. So, the kimchi was only $4.99, you guys. $4.99. And you're getting 10.6 ounces for $4.99. All right. Then we're on to, let's see how we picked up some eggs from the Asian grocery store. This is 18 eggs um, from Farm to You, Fast and Fresh. Today's farm, you get grade A medium white eggs. And their eggs were, hmm. The eggs were $4.99 for $18. Not too bad. Not too bad. $4.99 for $18. So we picked them up. Always got to have eggs in my house. And then we were running out of black pepper. Hubby picked this up. This is the McCormick Pure Ground Black Pepper. Um, this is just the 1.5 ounces. I love ground pepper. Um, Hubby likes those big things, peppercorns. I'm not big on that. So he picked that up. I don't know where he got it from. Let's see. Um, I don't know, you guys. He might have got it from. Hmm. Okay. I don't know which store he got this from. I don't know the price. I think he said he stopped at Dollar General, you guys, too. And he may have picked this up for like $2 or something like that. We know we could have went to Dollar Tree and got it for cheaper, but he wasn't in that area. Okay, we picked up some of the produce from the Asian grocery store. They always have good produce. Here's some apples. Um, I was trying to see what kind of apples these are. Jonah Gold. And these are really pretty. Look at that, you guys. Picked up some of those. Maybe like four of those. They have a variety. Their produce, you guys, is off the chain. Um, any kind of fruit you want, you usually can find. And let me see how much these were. The Jana apples were $3.58 for four. Not too bad. And then he picked up some of this sliced papaya. Yummy. Um, this was 0.91 pounds. Cost $4.54. Hmm, a little bit high. Got about eh, that much, you guys. Uh, and that was $4.54. We picked up some of the bok choy. You guys, I love, love, love bok choy. Goodness gracious. I love it in my soups. I do love it as a side too. And we got a big old bag of bok choy here, as you can see. See how nice their produce looks, so pretty and green. Um, The bok choy. Let me see, where is it at, you guys? The bok choy, the Shanghai bok choy was $1.76. So this whole thing of bok choy and look at all that, you guys, for $1.70-some cent. Look at that. So we picked up the bok choy. We also picked up some of these oranges. Let me give you guys a look at these. Ooh, yeah. They look like nectarines. I don't know. We'll check it out and see. These were... Okay, no, these are California oranges. They're just a little small. It's a California orange, you guys. Um, the California oranges were $3.16 for four of those. Okay. Then we picked up a whole 
slew of green onions. We love to use green onions. Probably has two packs. This, we use these in soups. We use these in all kinds of dishes. I love green onions, you guys. Um, I love to mix them with regular onions. I just love, love, I love onions, period. So, um, and these will last us a bit. Um, the green onion, well, they call them scallions. Um, two at, they were two for a dollar. So you get two packs, two packs. See how this got a thing around it? You get two of these packs for a dollar. If you didn't have nothing else, you guys, and you just bought this and some broth, you could cut these up and make some good old onion soup. Oh my goodness, yes, yes, yes. So these were two for a dollar. At the Asian grocery store, I'm telling you, the produce and the everything is off the chain. Um, Hubby picked up some, ooh, some good old broccoli. We love broccoli in my household. I don't care what you do to broccoli, we love it. So there's the broccoli. He got like maybe two bunches of the broccoli. Um, and let's see, you guys. The broccoli was, the crown broccoli was $3.05. That's not bad. Three dollars and five cents for all that, and this is fresh broccoli. This ain't frozen. This is fresh. You can cut it up to your liking for your different meals and stuff. So we picked that up. Then um, I could spend all day in the in the Asian grocery store, you guys. How do you pick these up? These are crab ramen. You get four packs. Oh, cool. And we use these with soups. Like we'll make these into a soup with this crab ramen. We'll add the green onion. We might add some bok choy. We can add whatever veggies we want, and I love it. Um, so he picked these up. Crab ramen. Um, you get four packs in here, you guys. So this is kind of cool. And how much were these? Hmm. Okay. The crab ramen was $5.49 for four packs. Not bad. And this is a better grade, I think, than, you know, than getting the regular ramen at the Dollar Tree or wherever. So we picked those up. Um, what haven't I told you guys? Okay. Now we picked up, we love, love, love oysters. So hubby picked up some of the fresh shucked oysters. Um, this is eight fluid ounces. And it's just a, you know, a container of these. We will cook these up. We will saute them. We will fry them. We will do whatever, but we love oysters. I will eat oysters right out of the shells. I don't care. I love oysters. So um, we picked these up. I think hubby picked up, yeah, he picked up two of these, two things of these. Um, and that was, we got these from Weiss. So let's see what the price at Weiss is. Oh my, well, the price at Weiss, these are $12.39 a can, you guys. So they're a little expensive, but they are yummy. So we picked those up. Um, then how we picked up some of these Arada potatoes, golden crinkles, French fried potatoes. Now he normally makes his own potatoes, but it's Friday night, so we're just gonna do these, and these are wonderful. Um, he picked these up. These were from Weiss also, and they were four dollars and forty-nine cents for the bag. And the bag, let's see, you guys, has thirty-two ounces, two pounds. Not bad. Four dollars and forty-nine cents for a two-pound bag. Okay, we can take that. So that is it, you guys, for everything. Um, here's everything we picked up. Again, the oysters, the eggs, the pepper, the kimchi, the crab ramen. This is four packs in here for $5.49. We got the orada potatoes. Um, again, we picked up the shrimp tempura, the apples. Oh, and they look so yummy. We got some of this cut papaya. We got the bok choy. We got the oranges. We got the green onions, two for two packs for a dollar. And we got the broccoli. Um, all of that, you guys. And let me give you some. Oh, I forgot. And we got and we got the rockfish. And we got the bagogi meat. So our total from H Mart, you guys, was $54.44 from H Mart. Okay. And then our total from, from Weiss was 
$51. So, yeah, like $104 between the two stores. And we did get meats between the shrimp tempura, the rockfish, the oysters, the bagogi meat, you know. So it wasn't too bad. Didn't do too bad. If we hadn't gotten the seafood, it probably would have been a little cheaper, but we wanted seafood. So anyway, again, look for your nearest H Mart or your nearest Asian market. Um, the prices are going up. Me and hubby have been going there for years. And a lot of these items used to be somewhat cheaper, but the produce is staying pretty around the same. And they always have good produce. So check them out, you guys. All right. Talk at you later. Lady C has got to go. Bye-bye, y'all.